you guys are going to have me do is start here, go to the picture, go around and go to the steps, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, you're good to go? Yeah. Okay. Welcome to the... Oh, no. Welcome to the Breezedale, one of the oldest buildings on this campus and one of the more beautiful buildings. This building has not always been uh, associated with beauty. As a matter of fact, it's had a good bit of horror that has occurred here. It all started back in the early 1900s, to our best guess, when a young student named Emily Foss would reportedly come to this building almost every night. There, we have, nobody knows why she came to this building. There's really no good place to study. But she would sit in this chair right here and turn it and stare at this picture, this old lady. We have no idea who this lady is. Okay, here we are. We had to twist a couple arms, but we got permission to actually come up in the tower and do a little bit of filming. This was where it all took place. Now, before the renovations in the 1940s, this was a bell tower. If you could imagine the bell tower hung from a board right where this light is. She threw the rope up over, proceeded to hang herself. Now, if you look around, this room has enough windows in it that it can be seen from anywhere on the entire campus. It's just very eerie up here right now. And perhaps we should get out of here, just in case the story is true, we would miraculously see her. So, you think that's going to work? Yeah, it that, should. I mean, we can always go back and try it again if you want. I, uh, really, yeah. I really don't want to go back. I'm yeah, getting, I know, I'm getting bored with it. Yeah. We we need to go get uh, Tris, Chris, yeah. stupid Get his ass kid. up. Yeah, no, lazy ass. All right, let's go get him and see what we're going to do. All right, let's go. Okay, you ready? Well, we know why he wasn't here last night. Yeah. Right. And we're here this morning either. Come on! Get up, you piece of shit! Gotta go film! What is it? It's your partners! Dawn, Dawn, come on! Kids. You ready? What time is it? It's like noon, dude. Yeah. You ready? No, I'm gonna go to sleep. Fuck this. No, 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 dude. Come on! Alright, well, gotta go see them. Uh, dude, I can really make you cry. <laughs> I know. I am so sorry for everything that's happened, because it's my project. Man. No, I, I got it. Yeah. Okay, okay, thank you. Well, Please put it down. It's wow. intersection. I, this is phenomenal. This is like one of those cool Scorsese things. Wow, man. Stop! What? We got Turn it. Turn the fucking camera up. You can't even walk on a little drive. All right, all right. We're good. All right, so uh, I want to know if you've ever heard of the, uh, the ghost story that happened here at Breezedale, where Breezedale is. Yeah, I've heard of it. You've heard of it? Yeah. Do you believe in the fact that if you see that woman hanging from the top I of the I never heard of that. Though. That's the yeah, that's the theory. Really? The woman, if you see her hanging, you're going to die. That's, you know, wow. You're going to die the well, same way she died. Well, that many people died at my UP? I don't know that they have. Just dumb ways, <laughs> but no. So really? do you believe in that? If you think um, I, I don't know. Yeah, it's kind of bizarre. I suppose if, I don't know, if I saw it, I'd... A little scared, but I don't. I don't know if I believe it. Right, or well, not. I'm pretty skeptical about that. Kind of yeah, if you see it, don't look. Okay. Yeah, no. <laughs> all right. Well, that's about it. Thank okay. You. Thanks. I, Thank right. you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay. Girl. You heard of the breeze cell ghost? Just chew your nut if you if yeah. You believe in it? Yeah. yeah. Hey, look at that. He 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 believes, dude. He totally believes. Look at him eat that nut. Oh man, oh, he's a big nut. Oh, that's whoa. So have you heard about the story about the Breezedale thing? Yeah, I have. Man, this stuff scares me. Does it? Yeah, it does. Yeah, it weirds me out, too. Yeah. I don't believe in it, but it's oh, okay. Oh, I do. You do? Yeah. yeah. You know, like, if you find a woman hanging, you're going to die, right? Yeah. So, oh, know. I've been looking. Believe me. You shouldn't be, though. If you see it, then you die. So you, then don't do that. I won't be looking. All right, cool. You know, I worry about you, you know? I don't even know you, but... Yeah, I'm hey, sure you do worry. Mm -hmm. All right, well, thank you very much. You've been a great person to interview. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is great. Let's go do interviews with people. Oh, um, where are you? I'm a communications major. Did you do an interview? No, I can't talk. <laughs> Sad but true. What do you want to do? I want to be a news person. Well, can you answer my question? Oh, I'm scared. <laughs> Camera, what am I going to do? Well, that's what happens when you're a newscaster. Oh, I won't be scared then. You should have done it on camera right now, please.
Guff? Guff. Alright. Uh, have you ever heard the uh, whole story about Breezedale? Yeah. Yeah. Alright, well, there's this theory, right? He was going to hung herself. Alright, like way back in the day. I don't know if that happened. And I, I, I don't think she gave me an AGD. That's why she did it. <laughs> yeah, so. Anyway, uh, she, so she hung herself, right? And now the theory is if you see her shadow or ghost or hang or whatever, you're going to die too. You believe in stuff like that? I'm yeah? I don't believe in that one. You should. It's true. I had a really weird feeling that maybe by the end of this movie it might happen. I don't want to give it away. <laughs> All right. Well, okay. thank you so much. Hey, if you ever find my pants, let me know, okay? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you. Thanks. That was I've never met you before, have I? <laughs> no. Okay. I never saw you in my okay. life. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> you have a good day. Thanks. Good sure. Downtown Indiana. Would you please not hit this truck? Thank you. What? I'm not hitting anything. Everybody pulled over. Hey, it's yellow now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. everybody pulled over by the cops, so you're like. <laughs> driving with one eye. Like, excuse me, sir. Come with me. Whoa. Whoa. Man, we are downtown Indiana. We are right. so downtown Indiana. Does this move up anymore? No. Well, it can, but it's broke. Check this out. Come here, come here. Fat guy stuck in the tractor. Oh, there you go. Fat guy in a little car. Nice. Eagles are on dip. <laughs> hey, Tom. Okay, goodbye. What's up? I mean, pizza from the hub. I'm Black Cafe. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. So, what are you guys, what are you guys using for a tent? Who's tent using? We're just gonna like put sleeping bags on the benches out in front. Oh, that's correct. Okay. What? Huh? We're sleeping on benches. We're sleeping on the benches, dude. Watch him get in. Yeah, why don't you watch me kick your ass? That sounds pretty good to me, buddy. I'll take you up on that. Oh, the camp and we will go. Bert. Oh, oh my God! Oh, 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 the Blair Witch of IUP in a goat voice. That's right. Yeah, in a goat. <laughs> <laughs> Geo <laughs> tracker, baby. Nice door, I baby. Like it on Earth. Yeah, now you screwed it. Nice. <laughs> Hey, you need a real man to close that. Hey, hey, I got it, I got it. Like, the building's sitting right in front of us, right? Have you ever, no, not this one, this one. Right. Have, have, you ever, have you ever been in it? I've walked past it before. I, I, I'm what you call stupid. No, have you ever been in it? No. Okay, it looks like a museum. Like, yeah, that's there's, like, good. art and, like, sculptures and, like, like classical music being, like, billowed throughout the hallways. And, like, these are the elite of the elite, yet they go to IUP. Secondly... Like they make it conducive to they make it very conducive to learning. And then they stick us in buildings like Ash and and, and, and like Stewart and wherever the fuck and, okay. Okay. Uh, like, what did I have when I lived in Ash? Oh I had the mad shitter. The guy who shit in a bag and put it in front of people's doors. <laughs> That's real conducive to learning. Um, fire thrower. You almost ready. Yeah, uh, you gonna do your trick or what? It's not really a trick. I don't know if I, I don't know if it's gonna work. It's gonna work. Let's see, it's really pathetic that we're gonna spend our evening with watching me throwing fire out of my hand. Hey, dude, you got something better to do tonight? Don't answer that. Don't answer that. Don't answer that. Whoa, oh, man, oh, wow. you're, you're incredible. That is the third coolest yeah, thing I've seen. That's great. Yeah. What's the first and second coolest thing you've seen? Well, I don't know their names, but we interviewed them. Click on them now, guys. Dude, we're sleeping out tonight. I don't want to sleep out. Come on. We're sleeping out. Will you throw your look fire now or what, dude? Dude, see the on there? look at down there. We're sleeping out down there. See, see the benches? We're lighted. Hey, there it is, fellas. Yay. Yay. Do you think she's up there? Um, let's see. No. Dude, you didn't even look. Don? Tell me about it. Don will die. I hope he dies. <laughs> Chris, I love you. No, like, I really hope Brother, you Brother, you are so nice. I really, because you know what? If I wake up and you're still alive, I'm going to bludgeon you to death with this. Is that like foreshadowing or something? Don, you're going to die. Ooh. Okay, guys, I'm going to turn up the camera for a little bit. Try to get like a half hour of sleep. Half hour sleep. Yeah. Guys, yeah, it's still sleep, and I heard something woke me up up here on the uh, porch, porch, porch debris cell.
God, what's that? Hello? Hello? Hello, God?